<coughs> Hello everyone, this is Abdi Physics Academy, the channel that strives to make you comfortable with physics. In this video, I will kill the wrong attitudes toward physics and show you how it actually explains the world around us. So if you are new here, please subscribe to the channel and if you are already family, don't forget to like and share the video with your friends. Let's get started. Physics is not just about equations, numbers and symbols written on a board. It is the science that asks the most important question of all, why? Why do objects fall to the ground? Why does the light travel in straight lines? Why does the universe exist in the way it does? Physics is not a subject locked inside textbooks. It is the language of nature. The moment you ask why, you are already doing physics. Many students think of physics as something to stand, something related to daily life. But the truth is, physics is everywhere around you. When you walk, your muscles push against the ground. That is Newton's third law. When you ride a bicycle, balance, motion and friction are working together. When you throw a ball, gravity and air resistance decide its path. Even your voice depends on physics. Sound waves travel through the air so your friend can hear you. When you cook, heat transfer is at work. When you switch on your phone, electricity flows through circuits designed by physics. Every moment of life, whether simple or complex, has physics inside it. Physics is not separate from daily life. It is daily life. Still, many students believe physics is a difficult subject. And it is true. Sometimes physics looks complicated. But here is the secret. The difficulty comes from how it is taught, not from what it really is. Too often, students see only formulas like F equals MA, V equals IR or E equals MC squared. These formulas can feel like a well-blocking understanding. But remember, formulas are not the starting point. They are the finishing line, a short answer to a big question. Take F equals MA. Instead of just memorizing it, ask the real question. Why does pushing harder make an object move faster? That is the heart of physics. The formula is just a way to write that idea in a simple way. Physics is not about memorization. It is about understanding, asking questions, and making a sense of the world. At this core, physics is about curiosity. It begins with a single word, why? Why does the sky appear blue? Why do stars shine for billions of years without burning out? Why can a heavy airplane made of metal lift into the sky? These are not random wonders, they are deep mysteries of nature. Physics is the tool we use to answer them. When you look at the blue sky, physics explains how sunlight scatters in the atmosphere. Shorter blue wavelengths scatter more than red, making the sky look blue. When you see stars, physics explains how nuclear fusion powers them. When you watch an airplane fly, physics explains how wings create lift from moving air. The world is full of questions, and physics is the science of asking and answering why. Physics is not just theory. It shapes everything around us. Without physics, there would be no electricity lighting our homes at night. Without physics, there would be no smartphones connecting us across the globe. Without physics, our buildings would not be safe, our bridges would not be strong, and our transportation would not be possible. Physics has given us medical imaging to see inside the human body, satellites that connect the world, and rockets that explore space. Every piece of modern technology, from the smallest microchip to the largest spacecraft, owes its existence to physics. When you look at the world today, remember this. Physics is not just important in real life, physics created modern life. Behind every discovery, there is a curious human being who dared to ask why. Isaac Newton asked why the apple falls, and from that question came the law of gravity. Marie Curie studied invisible radiation and her work saved millions of lives through medical treatments. Albert Einstein asked what happens if you chase a beam of light, and from that thought, came the theory of relativity. These scientists were not superhumans. They were ordinary people with one extraordinary habit. They kept asking questions. Curiosity turned them into pioneers. And the same curiosity lives in you too. 
which is not only about the past or the present. It is also the key to the future. From renewable energy that powers our homes to space travel that reaches beyond our planet, from artificial intelligence that transforms technology to quantum computers that could change the way we think about information, all of these advancements are built on physics. The challenges of tomorrow, clean energy, sustainable living, space exploration, and medical innovation will be solved through physics. When you study physics, you are not just learning about today's world, you are preparing yourself to create the future. So here is the truth, physics is not a difficult subject, it is the most human subject of all because it begins with curiosity. Physics is not about memorizing equations, it is about looking at the world and asking why. Why does this happen? Why is the nature the way it is? The moment you ask why, you are already thinking like a physicist. So, the next time you see stars in the sky, hear thunders in clouds, or even use your phone, remember, there is physics at work. Physics is not something far away. Physics is life. Physics is curiosity. Physics is the endless journey of asking why. This is all about today. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, Please do it now and support us by liking and sharing the video. Until I see you in the next video, have a nice time, one love.